What's up, Domus? What's up, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Um, you know, you, you had that avulsion fracture in your thumb, and that's what they got with De'Aaron Fox. How similar are the two injuries, and how what insight have you kind of given them in dealing with the pain? I'm not a doctor, so I don't really know exactly how similar the injuries are, but um, I just know he's going to play. You know, I texted him, you're playing, <laughs> and we're getting this game. So um, I'm happy he's playing, and that's all that matters. Just how huge is that for you guys that he's playing and that you've got him? You've got oh, it's him. big. I mean, I think we wouldn't. We wouldn't shut up if he didn't play, you know. So uh, we're, we're we're happy he's on the court. He made a decision early, and we're good. How worried when you first heard the news? Were you worried that you beat the Falcons? Uh, yeah, of course, because you know it popped up on on Twitter, Instagram, whatever it was, you know. And uh, we knew after the game he got hit, but we, no one knew to what extent, you know. But called him quickly, and we're good. How does he look in your opinion? Oh, he's great. You know, he's ready. You know, he's not trying to pay attention to it, you know, and just uh, fight through it. You got a game five in a 2-2 series. How important is, is getting tonight at home? Uh, it's big. You know, we're at home. We got to protect home court, you know, uh, in front of our fans. You know, um, I feel like it's going to be a good one. Are you ready for a breakthrough game? You've kind of had some struggles yeah. here. Uh, no, I'm not even thinking about that. I'm just thinking of what can we do to win? You know, um, there's a lot of we've been playing good defense, but I feel like there's moments we we can play better and play 48 minutes you know and the, the playoffs is about the team you know there's nothing important obviously if if i do better it might help the team but at the end of the day you know we just need to get win you know everyone's going to be happy if we win so that, that that's, that's definitely the goal coach talked about cleaning up the transition offense what have you kind of seen when it comes to that? uh just like he said you know there's a lot of shots that we just jumped in the air you know off one foot and then hoped for the best you know on the road that's not going to happen you know so i'm um, just being smarter with the ball in, in those situations, because we did get a stop. We're running in transition. We do have an advantage. Might as well take advantage of it and, and, and get two or three points, you know? So just being smart with that, and that's what I mean. Like, if we can just do better in those little areas throughout the game, you know, it's, it's going to come a long way at the end of the game. Have you been satisfied with the way you the series and the way you played and tried to figure out some of their defensive uh, Yeah, of course. You know, um, obviously, we feel like that. That last one was on us, you know. Uh, we definitely felt like we had a chance to win, and um, we came up short. But that's why it's a long series, you know. And we have home court today, and uh, we, we got to go take advantage of that. Do you feel you have to play any sort of different role with the way you know, Aaron does have this injury and, and having to do I think it's going to be exactly the same, or even better. You know, I've been saying that all year. You know, he's going to come up. He's going to show up. Going back to your injury, what Sorry. have you done? What have you done for kind of pain management when when it first happened? Maybe a little bit. Uh... Um, you know, just treatment. You know. Same staff is taking care of him, you know, so we're in good hands, you know. He's, 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 he's going to definitely be ready, you know. The fans are going to help, too. <laughs> what have you learned about your team's process with how you want to Just, you know, every, everybody's locked in mentally, you know. Uh, we played closer to 48 minutes than we have all year, you know, on the defensive end, you know, and uh, that showed. That's how we got those first two wins, so we got to keep putting that together. Has asked for any advice going through? No, you know, he's, he's good, you know. Um, he was... He kept it quiet when it happened, and then when it happened, he was like, I'm playing, so, you know, we're, we're confident in him. Do you feel that this, when you look at the series as a whole, like, for your team, do you feel kind of going to these next three going that hey, they haven't even had our best shot yet? Um, they probably feel the same way, you know. I feel like every team feel, feels that way, you know, but um, we just got to put a whole, a, a whole game together, all, all the little pieces that matter, you know, and um, if we can do that, it's going to be a good night. I'm not trying to get you in trouble with the, the officials, but how do you get to the line more, especially with the last game? I'm not getting there at all. I don't know. You know, I'm trying to be aggressive, shooting the same shots every game, being inside, you know, banging in there. So, um, you know, maybe be smarter with the ways I'm going up and stuff, but uh, we'll see tonight. All right, thank you, guys. Last one, guys. got to go. As successful as you guys were in game four on the court, just how good they are at home? Uh, yeah, of course. We can definitely use that to for our for our mental toughness, you know, know that uh, we can compete in their court, but it doesn't matter. We got to take care of business tonight, you know. So um, all focus is tonight. All right, thank you. Thanks, Thanks guys. Thanks, Thomas.